we're dead. We're dead. We're dead. I am going to die here. Uh, Cove, you can handle this, right? <laughs> Turkey Man is back, boys. I love this outfit. <laughs> I know it's so stupid and ridiculous, but I just absolutely love it. And I feel like it's bought us good look, right? Like, since we've been wearing it and since we've crafted it, we've had pretty good luck in finding, like, decent teams and stuff. So I'm going to wear it today. Uh, have your little butt wiggle. Uh, there we go. I just love the jiggle on the eyes and everything, man. It's so fun. Uh, we're going to need some luck today because we're going to get a, another UT. Now, I can't remember what we have in there. We'll definitely go and check. But we need an opposite gender UT. We're going to be using that not just for the kibble, but also for when we do, like, alpha boss fights. We're going to need a UT that buffs us a little bit. So we're going to go fight a UT. But before we do that, I do want to breed up our Verazinos we got last episode because I do want to try see if the Verazinos are good. Uh, or what is it? They, they they have that reduced... Or they don't have that reduced damage on the turkeys. So I do want to try that out. There is a turkey up in the forest just outside there. We're going to check that out because if my scheduling is all correct, I think tomorrow, like as I'm recording this, tomorrow will be the last day of turkey trials. And then the day after will be the start of Winter Wonderland or something. So what I'm going to do, we're going to see if the, the Verizuna can actually handle killing the turkeys and if it can i can spend the whole evening just getting as many wishbones as we can to get all the final little bits and pieces made up i've got like 60 summit so i'm gonna crack open a couple chibis but i'm not gonna make anything big today i think tomorrow will be like the final turkey trials and all that good stuff so uh yeah we've got ut breed uh, we've got verizino breeding crack open some chibis ut taming that's the plan of action today now because I keep forgetting. I think the last few episodes I forgot. But if you do enjoy the episode, make sure you are whacking a like on the video. It does help support the channel massively. It helps me to understand what videos you like and don't like and stuff like that. Uh, subscribe if you do. It's completely free. All you got to do is press a button. That is it. Uh, if you want to support the channel a little bit more, you can become a channel member or a patron. You get an exclusive video every Friday. So one a whole video every Friday just for members of Patreons. Only you guys can see it. It's a bit a thank you for you for supporting the channel. We do some random games over there At the minute we've got fears of fathom which is a horror reddit um like story game really really interesting really really cool we've got um dino trauma which is a dinosaur horror shooting game which is really cool and then just some other little bits sprinkled on top so uh yeah i appreciate all of you members and patrons thank you very much also if you want to grab an axeman hoodie link in the description also servers link in the description let's get cracking dodos get out the way let's go and get us a couple chibis so we've got 62 um hmm so if I'm looking at these, I want this one. So that's 30. That's also 30. I do want a sweater at some point. We've got all the hats. Mm, do I make one rare and two normal? That's what we're going to do. Okay. And then uh, that's used a lot, hasn't it? Oh, well, let's see what we get. A turtle. Okay. And we got us a penguin. Why does the picture on that look weird? And then our rare one... Oh, we got the Fila Chibi, boys. Okay. I'm feeling that. Right, let's have a look at the turtle. Uh, I am not naming you yet, Mr. T oh, it's pink and purple. Oh, my God. Why is he sunk in the ground? Can you come over here? Oh, that's amazing. Oh, I love him. I actually love him. That is just beautiful. Okay, penguin. Uh, it's green. Oh, green and a bit of blue. You got a big noggin. Okay, I mean, uh, if you're into penguins, maybe that's good. And the uh, phyla. Come on, pink, pink, purple phyla. Okay, just kind of a box standard phyla. Oh, you look mean. Oh, you look mean. He looks really angry. Why are you angry? What happened? Is it because you just were born and you saw a giant turkey man? I mean, it's kind of got, like, yeah, like a really pissed off face. Okay. Yeah. All right. The fire is pretty cool. I mean, the turtle, though. That shit's fire flame. Look how bright and pink he is. That's amazing. All right. We're definitely going to have to put a couple more of these on display at some point. Uh, let's put yous back. Let's get Miniax back on there. He's my boy and there we go right they're all chilling in there so yeah i don't really have much room um hmm i mean i could put a bunch more up here i don't know actually i'm not sure 
Because I think I still got to put two more artifacts up in here as well. Oh, you know what? Um, I completely forgot last episode, but we have something bad happened. Um, the other day, I walked in the door like this, looked down, and there was a dead Otterax. I may or may not have forgotten to feed it because it only eats fish meat, right? Um, so yeah, I need to get another rider before I do some of the caves. Uh, <laughs> my bad. Yeah, my bad. Uh, I apologize for that. Anyways, moving on. Let's pretend like that never happened. Let's go and put our Verizinos on breeding and let's start the baby process off them. And then we can go check what uh, gender Yuti we need. So these are the dudes we got last episode. We've got a black and red Verizino, which just looks amazing. That was a 145, I think. And then we've got this dude, which I believe might have been a 140. Uh, I forget. It feels like it's been so long. But in here... Uh, you had better melee and you had better health. Yeah. So what I'm going to do, uh, let's get you guys on breeding. All right, I'm going to grab this egg. How long until you breed again? Currently mating. Are you sure about that? All right, six minutes. Perfect. So the first baby will just, you know, whatever it is, that's what we get. But obviously going forward, we need one. We need a perfect male and female that has all the best stats. But I can do that in my own time. Now, in terms of a UT... We got us a male, so we need a female, 130 and above. Because I think you was like, oh no, you look, we lost levels on you, didn't we? That's it. I was thinking why you were such low level. You was like a 120, but we figured out you pretty much was a 110. So we need like a really good UT, a 140 and better perhaps. All right, female axe, right? Female, got to remember that. Female, high level UT. Female, high level UT. Female, high level UT. That's what we're looking for. All right, we'll let them breed in silence for a little bit. Let's go crack this egg open and see what we get. Could you imagine if we get a mutation first time? That'd be kind of amazing. All right, pop that down. A few seconds. So yeah, whatever we get out of here, we'll take. That could be the one we raise up and kill a few turkeys with. I have to say, the Verazino egg is definitely the coolest looking egg. Black and like pinky, purple, lavendery color. I know, man. I just, I really vibe with it. Really like it. All right, this chicken's going to hatch and this is going to be the first thing it sees. This is what it thinks its mother's going to look like. I mean, it kind of makes sense. Uh, all right, what we're saying, 203. Got some blue underneath. Any mutations? No. All right, so 6,400 and three five five i think that's the best health for melee right i'm pretty sure it is okay uh i need to get some berries real quick thank you peanut appreciate that all right mr baby uh can i put these on you perfect all right uh can you follow me just over here a little bit so we can have a good old look at you Let's see. Oh, he's, he's sliding across the floor. Look at him. Doesn't even need to walk. Um, wow, you are a little chunker. I love it. Um, all right, four minutes for a imprint. Let's get the first imprint, see how much we get. It's a bigger boy, so I'm going to guess maybe four or five imprints. Uh, with the Rex, I think we got to 60% growth before it was fully imprinted. So I'm going to guess it's going to be somewhat similar. So we'll probably, you know what, we might as well just get him fully grown and then take him out. I've got all day. We could chill here with this little guy. Hey, look. He's only just bigger than Miniax. Crazy. Um, hmm. It says Verizino wants to be hand-fed as rule bearer. Right. I didn't have an as rule berry on me. But. <laughs> okay. I mean, I would have had one because you'd have had one. But it was... It was green. Uh, not green. It was blue. Cyan. Whatever that color is. Which means I had it. That was weird. Um, all right. So you got 23%. So yeah, we're going to need five of them. And you're already 9, 10% growth. Okay. Um, yeah, let me just chill here. Let me get it fully imprinted, fully grown and stuff. We'll take it out. Go and find that turkey. And then we can move on to some scary UE stuff. Look at his overbite. Look up. Don't look at me. Hey, stop looking at me with them big old face and eyes let's see look at it look at this massive overbite jeez all right i'm gonna go make a cup of tea get him grown up and i'll 
be back in a little bit. You know what? I have a turkey dance. There we are. <laughs> Amazing. All right, see you in a bit. All right, boys, we're back. And Mr. Verrazino here told me that they are ready to go and eat some turkey. And I couldn't agree more. I would love just a, a roast turkey dinner right now. Oh, God damn. I'm definitely not hungry and starving or anything. <laughs> well, that made my mouth salivate a little bit. All right, so up here should be... Actually, can we grab a few levels, maybe? Do we get levels from just, like, breaking shit? Eh, I'm sure we'll find some other creatures. But, um, yeah, so up here, maybe up this way. There is a turkey somewhere. Found him. There he is. Okay, right, let's try this. So left click, right click. See? There we go. See, just do 2 four, one damage. Interesting. Okay, that's kind of amazing. So we've got... I've got to say, we've got the Ascendant Verazino saddle we have. I mean, how much was our shotgun doing? I know our shotgun does, like, multiple pellets, but that was probably roughly the same. And my guy's, like, stuck down here. Sort of. So 241, it has, like, 10,000 health or something, right? So it's still going to take a while to kill it, but to be fair, it took a while to kill um, the one with the shotgun and all the um, plant species. But yeah, 241 is way better than 30. Oh, God, we got double turkey. We got double turkey action here. Okay. If I could get them to my base, plant species plus me, they're going to jump off after me. Uh, one did. One stuck up there. Can I hit him? Plus, uh... Wait, where's my plant species out front? Okay. Apparently, I don't have plant species out front anymore. Did Jim break them as well? Oh, my God. Now they're escaping. Oh, which one's the hurt one? Oh, this is awful. Okay. Oh, they're both here again now. Sick. All right, boys. One of you's going to be nearly dead. What's that health looking like? Oh, we're heavy again. Trees, man. I don't need you here. Okay. Um, I think we just killed one because there's a bag there, right? Did we kill one? I missed it. So this is a okay tactic. The only issue is I gather way too many berries and stuff. Oh, he died now as well. I gather way too many berries and stuff, and it just weighs me down a lot. Uh, four wishbones. Maybe we didn't kill the other one. Unless I just didn't pick it up. Hmm. I actually have no idea. Um, okay, I'm not going to spend hours looking for them. It's just a few wishbones. I can get some more. I can't believe my plant species disappeared from here. Like, the whole crop plots are destroyed. God damn it, Jim. D D Jim literally just came in and just, like, ruined me old base dinner. <laughs> oh, man. All right, so, Verazino, then. Um, it works. You would kind of have to do it maybe more out in the open. Being in a forest and stuff, it, it kind of sucks. Uh, they took us to uh, just over or under. Wait, over half health. Yeah, over half health. I uh, definitely want that to, like, 10,000, maybe. All right. That's... I mean, that's just good to know. That's good to know for you. So, like, the one to maybe have one final day on turkey trials. Get yourself a good Verazino and use the sea attack. All right, so we've got, got four wishbones from that dude. And either there's a very nearly dead turkey out there, or there is a dead one with, like, some wishbones in his bag, and we'll just never be able to get them, which sucks. But it is what it is. Okay, right. Now, we can go head into the snow and find us... A UT. So, when we tamed the other UT, uh, we did it on the back of Cove. We didn't use a trap. It didn't really go to plan, but it sort of did. And I'm going to do that again because YOLO, right? So, I believe we need a female, but we can check on here, right? Uh, yeah, we need a female. All right. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to head about in the snow. And as soon as I find that max level, there's going to be a 150 out there. Female, 150. There's me Giga. Or there's Jim's Giga. I kind of want to put him, like, unclaim him. And put him on aggressive and leave him somewhere in the wild. <laughs> that'd be, uh, that'd be scary. Maybe I should just put him on wondering and aggressive. Maybe deeper down in the snow, though, maybe. 
Um, all right, anyways, yeah, we're going to find this 150 UC. There's a there's a female 150 out there somewhere. I can feel it in my jellies. Uh, let me just check this one UT before we uh, take a cut, just in case it's amazing. It's a 25. I'm going to go and kill that, and then I'll bring you back. Oh, we're dead. We're dead. We're dead. I am going to die here. Uh, Cove, you can handle this, right? <laughs> Okay, I got Polovia'd about 10 seconds ago whilst fighting a Carno, and then I just got Polovia'd right in the middle of a pack of wolves. Um, sick. That's really cool. Is that that's my bed, right? Okay, that's my bed. I've got to fly over to there. Um, god damn it. So I need to fly over there and then come back. Jeez. Okay. Uh. <laughs> uh did they break all my armor as well? This is what I hate, the fact that I can't pick up a Barry with an RG. Yeah, I can pick up Filers. I can even pick up Kangaroos now as well. Um, Quetzal? I might actually need you for a hot second. Because it's not too far away, right? I could fly you, grab Cove, grab all my stuff, reset. Yeah, let's do that. All right, you know what? Have a bunch of Stam. Have a bunch of weight. Quetzal with no name. Uh, you know what? Let's call you... Um, I've got a name for you. There we go. Quarry the Quetzal. Just because it's got, like, grey stone-looking skin. Hell yeah. All right. Let's <laughs> do the slow fly over. And we'll just pick Cove and all my stuff up. Come home, repair my armor, and we'll head back out. All right, there's Cove dealing a lot of damage. There's also damage numbers being dealt to cove but it looks like they may have taken care of that all right we'll go down here cove nice uh you do look a little bloody though which is a little terrifying am i might call just to hop off here uh, nope cove gonna need you again cove there's there's a pig cove can you get the pig for me why is the pig not attack wait what um Okay. Can I whistle? Okay, can you get him for me? Interesting. <laughs> can pigs... Okay, there we go. I was going to be like, can pigs not hit a Quetzal? Okay. Right, I just want to grab me stuff before I freeze to death. Nice. All right. Now, we can heal Cove back at home, because obviously once you eat fish, you just heal straight away. Let me just put some of this on. Makes it a little bit warmer. All right. Let's go, Cove. You did really good. I'm really proud of you. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's get home. Let's reset. I have found a sim... Oh, God. Um, same to you. I'm trying to do stuff. There is a, a Syntag UT here. 141. Wait, is there two? Wait, what? Why has he got... What's happening? He has two? He has a level seven? Did he tame a level five, UT? Huh. What did... Are they on breeding? They are. No, I'm going to steal one of his eggs. <laughs> stole one of your eggs. So did he tame them, get them to breed, take the babies home... Hatch them up and use them as his kibble and just left these. That'd be that's the only reason. Or he's literally just tamed them and he's died. And he's coming back from. But why are they on breeding? That's weird. Anyways, we stole an egg. The egg's now mine. I'm going to. You know what? I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna eat syntax babies. You know what? That tasted delicious. <laughs> that was so yummy. Oh, bad. All right, where are we? We're gonna... Hmm. We're gonna follow left for a little bit. I think we tamed our other dude down the right. Okay. Uh, we've found a female 145. Not quite the 140, but that will do nicely. Um, I don't know how many UTs I've killed and been fear and had a run and... Oh, my God. It's been a whole ordeal. Where did that girl just go? He roaring. This is a horrible... Uh, that sounded like a double roar. 
He just killed a penguin. Well, that's what I'm looking for. Definitely sound like there was another one somewhere. All right, let. Oh, cool. All right, there's definitely another one somewhere as well. Uh, might be down by the beach. Ow. Oh, there you are. Hello. If you could keep following me, that'd be grand. So this is 145. It's gonna. Oh, it's probably gonna fear or us about five, six times, which um, it's it's not ideal. I don't really know what colours it is either. Uh, where you gone? Yeah, this this is the downside of not using a trap. I have no idea where you've just gone. So there you are. Yeah, you keep eating the penguins. You need penguins? Oh, shoot in the butt. How about that? All right, let's get to it. Why does that look... I don't know. She just looks really big. Like, you know what I mean? Tall and... I like it. Oh, I wish they had different sizes. I know there's a mod, or there used to be a mod for Old Ark, where all the creatures can be different sizes. I love that shit. Uh, oh, where'd you go? Why are you not following? Is that you running all the way down there? Okay, she's a feisty little one. Um, sick. Cove, how about we jump over rocks and not just get stuck on them? There she is. Now she's going to fear auras. Um, that's an Alpha Carno. Crap. Uh, you know what? Um, really don't want to be fear roared and be eaten by an Alpha Carno. That, that'd be bad. I think we need to take care of this guy. Uh, yep, there's a new... Oh, God. <laughs> oh, it's going to be another one of them. Uh, which, who are you? You're the 145. You're the one I want. Okay, with Fear Rod, there's two UTs and an Alpha Carno. Crap. What level is the Alpha Carno? Who knows? Sick. This is... Um, this is really bad. This is really bad. I should go and get a trap. I should really go and make a trap for this, shouldn't I? But I'm going to stick to my guns. Me in the turkey outfit? We're going to do this. So I have to get rid of... Who are you? Which one are you? Can't see. You're an 85. Okay, we need to kill you. Before you fear on me. If I go behind them... I can't see dicks. Hello? What's happening? If I stand behind them, do they still fear on you? Like, if you're not in the path of their fear or Is that a thing? Oh my god, this... The terrain we're on? It's awful. Okay, you're dead. Amazing. Carno, let's kill you. None of these are alpha boosted, which means the, uh... Alpha Carno is probably back up this way. I still hear the UT. Who's... <laughs> of course, chilling. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not attacking the UT, right? Okay. Uh, I think it's trying to. Crap. Don't jump off the cliff. Cove, remember rule number one of Utertainment, do not jump off the cliff. We might have to kill the Alpha Carno. Uh, do I have hell on me that's making me heavier? Okay, drop some of that. Okay. Yes, yeah, so they're doing a lot of damage. How am I going to separate these two? Okay, right. Um, I didn't think the Alpha Carno would eat the UT, but it is. Right, sir. I need to deal with you. UT, I need you to bugger off. You're just level 15. I can kill you, right? UT, go away. Don't... No! God damn it. UT, stop. Leave me alone. I'm doing this for your own good. Okay. Right. Try and kill this guy. He's hurt. UT, I swear to God! <laughs> doing this for your own good. Do not fear on me now. You dickhole. Actually, right, you know what? This is right. Run this way. Get stuck on there, maybe, Cove? UT, I'm going to need you to do your thing where you run away like you did a minute ago. Because I need to take care of this goddamn Carno that's here. God, that's doing near 200 damage to us. Do I hear another UT? Oh, my God. Here comes the Carno. Yep, sick. All right. I'm, I'm stuck. All right. This <laughs> is great. But UT, go somewhere else. Go and do other stuff. Okay. Right. I wonder if... I don't want to kill it. I wonder if... I kill the Kano and he eats the Alpha Kano. Right, yeah, yeah. Run away, run away, run away. Right, you follow. You come here. 
Perfect. This is all we want. Nice. All right. I accidentally ate it all. I forgot about that. I forgot that was a thing. Okay. Health-wise, not looking too good. You're going to fear roll me now, right? Yep. Nice. All right. But now you're not alpha boosted. So you shouldn't be doing that much damage. And if you get stuck on that rock, that would be poggers and coggers. All right. Still following us, which is nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eat these penguins. There's penguins somewhere, Mr. Yudi. Eat them. Don't eat me. Eat the penguins. Okay. And... Boom. Okay. See them just down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that. That's it. So that's distracting you. So I can actually shoot you a few times. You're probably also healing. You're now in a bush, so I can't see. Don't fear all, man. Don't know if that was the fear roar. I think the next roar is the fear roar. Yeah. Uh, okay. Just gonna have to tank you. Was that meant to be a fear roar? Did that not get us? This is good. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> None of us know what's going on. Okay, we're fear roared. Stuck inside of them. Health's halfway. It's not the end of the world. I think maybe... Two more ferals. We've got mutton as well because I killed a sheep. Okay. Cove. I'm going to need you to get stuck. Okay, that works. Thank you. Thank you, Cove, <laughs> for listening. Okay. Oh, there you are. Nice. Let's get straight back at it. All right, so I think one more feral, and then she might start running. And then we have to give chase. I'm trying to, like be inside of them so I don't miss my shots. I also kind of wanted to be like behind them in case that helped at all. Alright. Health's still doing fine. So yeah, I would not advise this method of taming. It's not great. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Be stuck. Okay. Nope. Find me again. Okay. That's a fear roar. Damn it. Try to get behind them. All right. Don't jump off the cliff. Don't jump off the cliff. Do not jump off the cliff. Get stuck on a rock, Cove. Come on. Don't jump off the cliff because I'm going to have to dismount you. This is not going to be good. Oh, is that the water down there? Okay. Oh, good. We slid. We slid. We're okay. Don't go in the water. Actually, you know what? We could probably heal in the water. Did the UT follow us? Yeah, don't go in there. Don't go in there. Oh, yes. Yes, they did. Okay. I can't get out the water. Amazing. Can't get out the water. I'm stuck here. Don't you be in the water as well. Oh, my God. Right. There's too many icebergs, man. What the heck? Let me get out. Great. We're going to be fear roared. As soon as we get out. Amazing. All right. Whatever. Here's what it is. Hopefully, a shark doesn't eat you. When you follow me into the water after you fear roar me again. All right. Health is not looking the greatest. It, it really isn't. Okay, there's the fear roar. Oh, no, 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 Cove, don't bite them! Turn the other way! Don't run this way! Ah, <sighs> god damn it. Mr. Yuzi, don't follow me in the water, please. Great, we're just gonna... <laughs> we're just gonna swim miles away. I'm also not breathing. Don't go down! Oh, man. Where's some fish? Are you, do you count as fish? If I eat you, do I heal a bit? think so. Alright. There's beauty. That's beauty's in the water. <sighs> She's not looking good. Not looking good at all. Alright, this is awful to try and get out of. Uh, are you in the water? I don't... Yeah, you are. I'm going to need you to get out of the water. Somehow. Really, game? Really? Come on. Yep, 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 yep. Let's go up this way. Come on. We're not torpor running now. Get out the water. I didn't think we did that anymore. Come on. Don't you dare. That's it. Yep, yep, yep. Get on some land. Uh, missed. Why are you swimming in the water? Um... Okay. Are you coming back? Okay, that's that's good. We want that. Come back. Maybe your torpor's dropping a bit. Right, can we get up here? Nope. 
Oh my god, Th this is awful. What are you doing over there? <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna shoot one into you to keep the torpor up, maybe. Right. Come on. You need to be out the water. I'm stuck inside of you now. Th this is all just a disaster. Alright, this is reason number 20 why you do a trap tame. There's no way. Bro, come on. Do something! Move! Why are you not moving or anything like that, man? Well, what was that? Oh, okay, we've got a sharky in it now. How about we don't, sharks? It's gonna die. It's gonna die. We've lost the Uta. It's... it's dead. It's 100% dead. And I killed him. Where'd the other guy go? You think you need to do something apart from standing there like a lemon? Go do something. Move, please. Oh my god. Sharks, mantis. Come on then, let's go. Is he being attacked again? What's he I can't really see what's going on. No, 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 no. Yeah, he's gonna die. He's 100 gonna die. Okay, there's the Meg. Right, you guys? Okay. I'm trying to eat him without fighting him. You realize I'm trying to save you, UT, and you're doing nothing to help. No, now you go away. Yeah, oh, well. Great. He literally did go away. Oh, he's swimming? No, why? Dude, move! I wonder if going out of render and coming back might be a thing. I wonder if it makes him... I wonder if it makes him move or something. Can I pick a UT up with a Quetzal? Is that a thing? I'm going to... Right, let me get on land. I'm going to get away from it. I don't think you can, but maybe we can. All right, let's get over here. Let's get away from it. Oh, man. This is... <laughs> this is one of the worst teams I've had on ASA so far. The AI is meant to be, you know, they don't run into the water when they're high torpor. They're meant to be smart. My guy's just chilling with his feet in the water, being nibbled on by all the sea creatures. A Tuso is the only thing that can carry it. An underwater creature. Right. Hmm... I don't know what to do here. I really don't know what to do here. Do we just go back and see what it's doing? Maybe it's out of it. I feel like because we've left and come back, there's going to be more sharks in the water. Um, This is where it was meant to be. He was there, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, what's, can we see what it says on it about... Dying. Okay, it looks like the 145 got eaten by something in the water. Unless it, like, somehow spawned out here? Hmm. Okay, well, that's a massive rip. Crap. Man. That was the perfect team. That would have been... <sighs> that really sucks. That really, like, everything that could have gone bad, went bad. We found the UT. There was two of them. We was, like, getting distracted. There was then an Alpha Carno. It then threw us off a cliff. It then got stuck on the water. It then got, like, doubly stuck in the water. I ain't died. Yeah, this was... This was a bad one. Uh, do you have x I'm gonna save that. God damn. Man... That sucks. I don't even think I can get up there. I think I have to run all the way around the outside to get up there. Or swim, pretty much. Uh, all right. Well, I think we're going to have to chalk that off as just a... Uh, I mean, it's not a bad day, but like we didn't set out which we wanted to do. But that's okay. We've shown that every day isn't, you know, really good and stuff. 
Oh, man. Uh, that'll like a Plovia thing there. All right. Carnos? Does that mean there's a UT around here? Normally, a couple of Carnos being a UT. No, just a bunch of Carnos. All right. What I'm going to do then, I guess, is we just make our way home. And, yeah, it's just... It's a fail. We got the Verazinos. Um, we've proved that they're good against the turkeys. So I can now, like, start breeding them, get them ready for the boss, uh, the dragon boss. Uh, we'll have to do a UT another day. Uh, I mean, I'm not desperate for it, but I would like it somewhat soon. What are the mammoths fighting? It's normally UTs or Daodons. Okay, it's Daodons. All right, well, yeah, we'll wrap it up and call it a day there then. So we'll try this another day. But if you did enjoy today, if you enjoyed seeing some, uh, you know, that every day is not a great day on Ark, it's a nice... <laughs> reminder about that then uh go ahead and whack a like go ahead and subscribe ring the bell whatever notifications follow on social medias ring the bell all that good did i say ring the bell bro i don't know i'm so just uh i'm over it all <laughs> all right have a little dance and i'll see you all soon all right bye